Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Thursday, December 12th, 2019. It is Football Thursday at DocSports.com. More on that in just a moment. If you've yet to become a member over at DocSports.com, all you got to do to give it a trial run, click on the link below the video, get set up for a free $60 account. You can use those free 60 bucks on any of my daily packages over at DocSports.com. And it comes with the DocSports guarantee. Simple as that. $60 free account. Get started by clicking on the link below the video. Great way to give DocSports.com a trial run. All right, listen, uh, we've got a free pick coming up in basketball on Thursday, and uh, we'll get to that. First couple of quick notes, uh, doing a little housekeeping. We had two plays yesterday. I ended up going one and one. We won again in the NHL. It's been a real nice season thus far, and a fresh off a seven-unit win two nights ago in the NHL. We came back last night and cashed with the Washington Capitals. Not as big as the play we had a couple of nights ago, but a win nonetheless. However, the loss was a top play on Michigan, and I get it. There's all those folks, if you listen to every radio show across the country talking about this game uh, on, on Wednesday, uh, you would have heard about, oh, we got a favorite, a home unranked favorite over a ranked team. And that's the way the line moved after the opening number. However, uh, even though it has like 4-0 run here, 3-0 run there, things like that, if you go back over the last decade or so, it, it's not a winning proposition. So I I recommend people to throw that out of the mix when it comes to handicapping uh, this kind of a matchup. However, uh, again, Michigan was not able to get the win. They pulled within four or five with about three minutes to go. It was 66-61 at one point. Uh, but what they couldn't overcome was a 20-6 to deficit in free throw attempts uh, and a big deficit, I think, minus nine in free throws made. And basically the difference in the game. So anyway, uh, we will go into Thursday's card still uh, hitting 60% in college basketball long term over the last couple of weeks and even though I don't have a premium college basketball play for Thursday it's a short card and I'm going to give you a free college basketball play in just a moment uh, we will be back in action on Friday I've already looked ahead we've got at least one maybe two sides uh, two plays for Friday's college basketball card so we're going to pass in college baskets on Thursday except for our free pick here uh, as far as the NBA we'll be in action at 1 p.m. Eastern 10 a.m. Pacific I passed on a Wednesday night as far as a premium pick. And for those who jumped on board before the line move, we eked out a win with that first half play here in the NBA last night on the free pick video. And uh, also NHL, I will be involved in what will be a six unit play on Thursday. Uh, we cashed, as I mentioned again last night, we're hitting about almost 60% for the season in the NHL. And that NHL play will be available same time as the NBA, 1 p.m. Eastern, 10 a.m. Pacific on Thursday, DocSports.com. Mentioned it's football Thursday over at Doc Sports because we post our weekend of plays every single Thursday, 6 p.m. Eastern, 3 p.m. Pacific. And I have my entire NFL card, which will be posted Thursday, 6 p.m. Eastern, 3 p.m. Pacific over at DocSports.com. You'll be able to get all my NFL for the entire week. And I do have a seven-unit play this week in the NFL. It's an underdog. I think you're going to like it. And I think you're really going to like it when it lands on the win column. But all the plays for Thursday, or I should say for the weekend in the NFL, will be available Thursday, 6 p.m. Eastern. Don't miss out. 86 and 59 NFL run uh, last seven weeks now we're going into our eighth week where we're 34 and 20 that's 63% uh, against the spread in football and those who have jumped on board have been cleaning up in football upwards of about 2300 one during this run for those wagering just $100 per unit don't miss out Thursday 6 p.m. Eastern 3 p.m. Pacific time a real quick note about the Jets Baltimore game which kicks off this week's NFL action it looks like Lamar Jackson is going to play the way he's been talking uh, he's sounding like he's going to play uh, the the tickets, the money, even though he's been a little bit banged up, Lamar Jackson still coming in heavy on the favored Baltimore Ravens, which right now power rate better than any team in football on a neutral field. Uh, they're up to 16 and a half, the total 45. And in a couple of the books that I get uh, information from, they're reporting over 60% of the tickets, over 60% of the money on the Baltimore Ravens for Thursday night's game. Just thought you'd like to be aware of the betting report between the Jets and the Ravens. All right, let's 
let's get to our free pick. It is a battle of the state of Iowa. And uh, in all due respect to Northern Iowa, Drake, Morningside, and all the other schools in the state of Iowa. But it is Iowa State hosting the Iowa Hawkeyes. Cyclones laying a couple of buckets here. If Iowa were to win this game outright, it would be the first time in 16 years that they've won in Ames, Iowa. I think Iowa State's going to get them here. Like the way they looked in a revenge game uh, against Seton Hall last time out. Uh, I think they're going to be a little bit too strong for the Iowa Hawkeyes. And I think they have the matchups to offset what Iowa does. Listen, I, I, I like Luca Garza, no doubt about it, for the Hawkeyes. I like the way this team is coached for the most part. But George Condit can offset what's going on for the Iowa Hawkeyes. And again, at home, I think they get the job done. In fact, the home team has won 14 of the last 16 meetings. So we're going to stick with that trend to continue. And in this instance, or this situation, to also cover the spread. Iowa State minus the points is our free video pick for Thursday. And again, football available 6 p.m. Eastern, 3 p.m. Pacific, 6 unit in the NHL at 1 p.m. Eastern for Thursday night hockey. And uh, listen, if you like the videos, click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. I do appreciate those who have done so thus far. I'm Scott Spritzer, DocSports.com. Let's put Thursday in the win column. I'll be right back here Friday by 5 a.m. Eastern, 2 a.m. Pacific with our next free play.